Well, when I first saw this video, I have to admit I was skeptical. One of our viewers first alerted us to this unusual object that appears to launch and land in the metro area. Tonight, an aviation expert tells us it's unlike anything he has ever seen. It's not a bird. You're going up and up and up. It's not a plane. Here it's flipping around. Even this aviation expert is mystified. Uh, I can't identify it. We first learned about these strange sightings when this metro area man, who does not want to be identified, brought us his home video. You're going to see a little burst of fire right there, kind of a thruster. He captured the images on his digital camera from a hilltop in Federal Heights, looking south towards downtown Denver. Mile High is right about here. He says the flying objects appear around noon or 1 p.m. at least a couple of times a week. You're going to see it come in from the top, do a little loopy doop. The strangest part is they are flying too fast to see with the naked eye. This is the video in real time. Oof, see it? That was it. But if you slow it down frame by frame, it's there. We altered the color contrast to help you see it. Here's another one in real time. This is what it looks like slowed down. We wanted to verify that the video we saw was legit. So our photojournalist came out here with his camera. He set up in the same spot on 84th and Federal, and he shot video from just before noon until just after 1. And when we slowed down our photographer's video, we saw this flying object. I would consider myself an expert. Aviation expert Steve Cowell is a former commercial pilot, instructor, and FAA accident prevention counselor. It's very strange. He thought he would have a logical explanation until he watched the video. That is not an airplane. That is not a helicopter. Those are not birds. Um, I can't identify it. Powell told us he knows of no aircraft that flies as fast. Because of the speed of the object, most people, I think, would miss it. Cowell did say there is one other possibility. Perhaps there's some sort of debris that's being raised up by some of the atmospheric winds. But in his professional opinion... As it fits the definition, it's an unidentified flying object. The FAA tracks all air traffic in Colorado and across the country. The FAA sent us a statement saying, We've checked with air traffic control and no one has had any reports of the activity you described nor have any of our employees observed anything of this nature either visually or on their radar displays. The North American Aerospace Defense Command is located in Colorado Springs. It keeps an eye on the skies in case of an air attack against the U.S. NORAD sent us this statement. Our command center reviewed their records and they did not have any noted air activity in the Denver area during the times you indicated. There's the smokestack. The man who first brought this to our attention believes the UFOs are launching and landing near 56th and Clay in Denver. A map shows only homes in the area. So is it a UFO, a secret military test, floating debris? The answer is anything but clear. It appears to be a mystery in the sky, a mile high.